You're an electrician. You're self-employed and on a job. You have to reach up to feed some cables through, so you stand on a table. You're only one metre off the floor. What's the worst that could happen? Hi, I'm Dr Marsden. Uh, I'm afraid it looks like you fractured your spine, so I'm referring you to our spinal injury specialist. Last year, over 2,000 people seriously injured themselves falling from low heights in the workplace. Don't be one of the casualties this year. Call 0845 345 0055 for information on how to be safe at all heights. Be safe, be careful, and take a moment not to fall. <sighs> Hello? Phil, hi, it's Mike from work. I just need you to go over your accident one more time for the record. Again? Yeah, sorry. Well, I was standing on a crate fixing a junction box. Crate collapsed, I fell, hurt my back. And how far did you fall again? Oh, about a foot. <laughs> Sorry, how many feet? One. <laughs> I'm on loudspeaker, aren't I? Yes, you are! <laughs> Pain's not all you feel when you fall from a low height. Every month, over 170 people discover that even a low height can be a high risk. For useful safety information, visit hse.gov.uk slash falls. Take a moment. Not a fall. Hello, Jack. Hi. I heard you're off work. What happened? I took a really nasty fall. You must have. Look at the state of you. Uh, Were you on scaffolding? No. A roof then? I overreached on a stepladder. A stepladder? How far did you fall? The second rung. What? The second rung. Sorry, which rung? The second. <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> all right, shut up. <laughs> Pain's not all you feel when you fall from a low height. Every month, over 170 people discover that even a low height can be a high risk. For useful safety information, visit hse.gov.uk slash falls. Take a moment. Not a fall.